Oh boy, it was a journey to get here, but I'm at Bye Bye Baby. <laughs> oh, traffic, almost running out of gas, but I made it. I have not gotten a single thing for this baby. It's kind of been stressing me out. I'm due like, I don't know, yesterday. So I'm gonna hop inside Bye Bye Baby, take a look around at everything. I have a list of things. I don't know if I'm gonna get everything here. You guys know I like to shop secondhand. Some things are nice to buy brand new so let's see what bye bye baby has to offer well it's been one of those mornings i'm looking through my notebook i don't have the list of things <sighs> okay pretty sure this calls for a chocolate bar and here we are let's roam inside right up front they have a ton of well a ton i don't know that's subjective halloween like my first halloween i think my favorite one is mommy's boo Oh, and then check out all these cutesy little baby books and then um, like hand print ornaments. Oh my goodness, the ultrasound. Oh, that's so sweet. The first year, I can't keep up with this stuff like that, especially with my fifth. Oh my goodness, announcement, telegrams, whatever that's called, a letter board. Do you guys do that cutesy stuff? I have never. Maybe I will this time around. Don't hold me accountable. The thing about stores like this is there's rarely any people here. Like, you know, it's not packed and stuff. Bye Bye Baby and uh, they used to have, what's the one like Toys R Babies R Us? Yes, okay. So I've made it to safety and safety, <laughs> okay. So the outlet, I know people uh, have differentiating opinions about this, but it's here for the low, low price of... It's so expensive, they just don't even put a price tag on it. Oh, humidifiers! These are fantastic, especially for the winter time to keep the air nice and moist. You know, even in Florida. This one's really cute. It's an elephant, uh, but it's also six dolls. Ooh, Munchkin air purifier? Okay, you know what I need? Sound machine, baby monitor. I thought they would have baby monitors here. I thought I saw a sign that said baby monitors. I see baby gates. Oh, more humidifiers. Oh, see, this one's $35. More baby gates. They have a lot of baby gates. You know what? We hired someone to install our baby gates on our stairs just because it was a really weird area. Best money I've ever spent because let me tell you, Every other baby gate we've ever installed <laughs> has not worked out. It's always like halfway fallen out of the walls and stuff, you know? Ooh, a total body pillow. <gasps> celebrate mom. Yeah, let's celebrate mom. It's a cuddle pillow. This is like a pregnancy pillow. My back breaks pretty much every night, but I refuse to spend <laughs> money on a pillow that I'm just gonna use for like a few more days, weeks, who knows. This baby nest, this is nice, a playful retreat. So that's probably similar to, oh, this thing, the Docatot. Yes, this was really popular for quite some time, remember? Um, yeah, I've never had it because, check that out. I personally feel like the boppy pillow can kind of uh, mimic the work of this, a snuggle me. I don't know, you know how it's only one side, but it's double duty. Okay, I found a couple sound machines over here. Cry activated? I'm not sure that would work in my house. There's too many noises, <laughs> but that's pretty, that's pretty cool. The Frida Baby brand, you guys are gonna find that. I am a huge fan of Frida, Frida Baby, Frida Mom, Frida Breast, whatever they put out. It's very innovative, amazing products. We'll talk more about them. I'm sure, I think from last time I was here, they have a lot of Frida stuff in one area. And look, wait, what are these things? Okay, sound machines. I need to know which one is the loudest. I need to drown out a lot of sounds. And the one I we've had for years and years and years and years, I've always gotten them off Amazon for like 20 bucks. Um, they're not very loud. And anyway, I'm looking for another one. Also a baby monitor. Mm-hmm, yep, baby monitor. The one that we bought 
actually from here three years ago uh, was not it, you guys, was not it. And I don't even see them selling it anymore. So I'm happy to see that <laughs> or not see that. Actually, there's a whole ton more behind me. Holy crap. I mean, this is just overwhelming. Like tell, just tell me which one is good, you know? Okay, 30 minutes later, <laughs> I've been trying to research and stuff. They have this outlet one that's on sale. It's a great brand, um, but it doesn't come with a monitor. It just has Wi-Fi to your phone, which I'm sure a lot of people would like. I think I'm gonna end up getting this one, the Hubble one. Um, it records and does has a lot of different functions, but also they have one with a dual camera, which I think is very cool, but uh, a little bit more expensive. So I'm not sure we need all that but uh, it's a great option. And then they have higher ones over here. And then uh, this is the outlet that tracks the breathing. You strap it to the baby's foot and it monitors the baby's heart rate. Um, so that is the price, $3.99. We were looking for it before. Oh, this one's $2.99. Oh gosh, Dream Sock Baby Monitor and Mint, Dream Sock and Cam. Oh, okay, so this one come, wait, huh? I'm confused. Do they not both come with a camera? Okay, well, if you're into it, you can do some more research. I'm like barely inside the store. I've been here for five hours. Look, there's so much to see, right? The, I mean, consumerism when it comes to baby products and weddings, it's insane. <laughs> the things that they put out and the money they try to make. Okay, this is a portable sound machine and a humidifier which I think is very cool. Also pretty reasonably priced for two of those things. I found a portable sound machine because I am in the market for one of these. This alone is $30. It is the Frida brand. I didn't even know they sold something like this. And then the air pure, oh, it's a three in one air purifier, sound machine and nightlight. Oh my gosh, stop it. Like how am I gonna decide? You know what I mean? So many options. Well, let's just go over these since we're here. Baby Basics Kit, it comes with the Snot Sucker. First of all, the names that they come up with on these things are amazing. The Gas Passer, the Snipper Clipper, and the Skin Soother. All good things to have on hand when you're having a baby. And then a Sick Day Prep Kit. This comes with the Snot Sucker, the um, AccuDose pacifier, very innovative, the vapor wipes and the vapor rub. And here are the vapor wipes alone for $5. Those are pretty cool. Speaking of the boppy, they have a wall of boppy pillows, also a ton of the different um, uh, pillow covers. <laughs> what are those called? Uh, yeah, okay, how much are these? Ooh, they've gone up in price, 60, but then this one's 45. I guess this one's more natural. All right, over here. Oh, sterilizers, hold on. Hands-free, cord-free. Love this, very similar. This is called the Willow. They also have one called LV, which I have. I think they're very similar in price as well. Breast, it's, a, it's a breast pump. This is portable and hands-free, which I mean, has so many benefits. Wrap yourself up in life, not cords. <laughs> Love that. They just have stuff cram packed in every corner of this store. These are like Wubbinubs, but the brand is Dr. Brown's and they have different, it's basically a binky with a little stuffed animal attached uh, to let the little hands like grasp onto it a little bit easier. The, oh, Baby Breeza. I've heard people say amazing things about that. $80, 110, 140, going up, 46, 75, and 75. And these are all like sterilizers, I'm pretty sure, for your bottles and all that good stuff, or binkies, whatever you need to sterilize, breast, uh, breast pump equipment and things like that. I use the boppy as a nursing pillow. I actually don't know if I still have my boppy. I don't think I do. I used to have two. Probably got rid of both of them. I don't know what I was thinking. They have this, my breast friend. Some people love this one. Best latch nursing pillow. Okay, that's one that's new to me. Oh, it's a boppy brand. Interesting. Oh, here, here we go. Nine month sitting, six month tummy time three month propping. So it's like a multi-use. It's also a nursing pillow. You can use it for whatever. Okay. So many new things to me on the market. Um, formula mixing pitcher. What? 
<laughs> I mean, a Baby Breeza one-step formula mixer. That sounds incredible. My first years. Oh, a bottle warmer. And even if you don't, is this a bottle warmer as well? A Munchkin one is up here. I'm sure that's maybe a better price. But if you are postpartum and it takes a while for your water to get warm in your bathroom, you can put your Perry bottle in a bottle warmer. That is a hack for you. And that way the water in your Perry bottle to like rinse yourself clean after you go to the bathroom every time it's always warm so that's a hack for you just for you okay oh look at this one i've heard people rave about this one as well the baby Breeza formula pro advanced it is a pretty penny 300 bucks uh, maybe you can find it secondhand but there you go <laughs> it connects to wi-fi what the heck here is the wall of hubba nubs or hubba wubba nub whatever they're called wubba nub I was talking about they've got a sloth oh how stinking cute is a little is that, is that a sloth or a manatee i think it's a sloth is this one a manatee elephant i don't even want a manatee why am i looking is this one a manatee oh my gosh it is <laughs> check on that wait is it a manatee or a seal okay so this is pretty cool um, Frida Mom has a belly wrap similar to this. This is called the Belly Bandit. And they actually have a few of them out so you can feel them and sample them and stuff. So that's pretty nice. We've got a bamboo one. They've got an extender. Uh, I've never used one of these, but you know, if you're into it. Oh my, this one might get me. Okay, I am in the market for a baby bath. I usually get the angel one that's like, I don't know, 15, 20 bucks, right? And uh, this one is the warming baby bather. Hmm, a warm bath for up to 15 minutes. Tell me more, the perfect temperature, warmed up surface, safe technology, ergonomic design, and anti-slip pad, and it fits anywhere. Does it fit anywhere though? It is $60, so a little more than an angel baby thing would be. We've made it to the diaper pails, I think, and check these out. A PPTP, I just don't have time for that. <laughs> but this looks like a new brand to me, Ubi Steel Diaper Pail, pretty sweet. Uh, looks like they have a lot of different options that you can like design them. Wipes warmer. This is something that I think is necessary for a newborn. It's a newborn. You don't want to wipe them with something ice cold. You know what I mean? You want something, mmm, you know, nice and warm. But some people don't care about wipe warmers. They don't like wipe warmers. Here's a diaper caddy, a wipes dispenser. Okay. Here's a touch-free wipe warmer for $50. Um, another diaper depot, $22. But I would much rather enjoy being wiped by something warm than cold, you know? So that's why we do wipe warmers. There's a few more diaper pails over here. The Munchkin one, oh my Lord, it's $73. What does it do? Well, it kills 99% up to 99% of germs. But if it's in the diaper pail, do I really care about killing germs? <laughs> I don't know. Just spray it out with Lysol when you empty the bag, right? I don't know. Oh, okay, bath stuff over here for bigger kids. They have this frog pod. It's pretty sweet to hold all the bath toys. Actually, this one looks interesting. Oh, it's $18 though. This one's bigger and it's 28. Lord almighty. I just use a drawer in our bathroom and line it with a towel. Boom, I saved myself 40 bucks. <laughs> oh wait, a drying bin. This one's 19. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool, pretty cool. I wonder if you can hang it. Oh no, that's how you hold it. Hmm, interesting. Oh my word, they've thought of it all. My size urinal. That is so cool, 23 bucks. Remind me to come back to the clothes section. They have a whole area of clothes. I don't have any clothes for this baby. But over here, I do see, this has been on the market for a while, this all-in-one elbow saver and kneeler. It's $36 and it just gives you a little support while you're giving baby a bath, which is nice. And here are a couple more bathers. Okay, the Forever Warm, I put it in my cart. I'm gonna think about that one. Oh, hold on a second, Aqua Scale. Okay, a digital scale, thermometer, two-stage tub, anti-slip pad, 
This is like next level. And then they have this one that crimps up and stores really nicely, which, ugh, you know, that is a definite pro. And then they have uh, these plastic ones. They've had those forever, I feel like. Look at this one, a recline and rinse bather. Oh, look at the baby. Okay, this is similar to the one that I typically get. It just has holes in it. It's really easy to clean, simple, affordable, 25 bucks. Oh my word, okay. The Grotto over here, we've got Sud Buds and uh, that's a pretty cool brand I've never heard of before. Shampoo rinsing cup for $6. And here's another baby uh, bather. And it is kind of like that Daisy one that I've seen a bunch before. Is this the Daisy one? A blooming bath. Okay, that's probably what I've been seeing. I imagine that's very hard to clean or keep from getting moldy. Oh, drift. Okay. I'm laughing. Check all of this out. I had no idea Frida Baby even had this. Control the flow. I just love their marketing. Their marketing team, just round of applause for them. And then this is really great for if your baby, which is very common if your baby has a cradle cap. So it's like a three-step system. Super simple to uh, remedy head, shoulders, knees, and toes, shampoo and baby wash, electric nose Frida. Oh, electric. So this one must be new, so you don't have to suck it yourself. I guess the machine does it. We saw those things. Soft sink baby bath. Folds for easy storage. Quick dry cushion. Hmm, interesting. Oh, and then some more no oh nose Frida. Vapor drops. Oh, vapor drops. For the bath or diffuser. Hmm, what does it do? Oh, bedtime wind down. Okay, well, do we believe that? Do we believe in the power of lavender? <laughs> Didn't work with my first, okay? Try as I may. Look at these pieces of furniture, though. They're on sale. This one's really nice. $429. Oh, <gasps> that is so smooth. A little wardrobe. <gasps> My baby doesn't have a wardrobe. Also like $429 is a lot of money. I've made it to the clearance section. They must have known I was coming. Oh, a two piece chair set. I don't need chairs, but like, that's a good deal. <laughs> Pop to play. Oh my gosh, a cardboard, uh, like car, a cardboard kitchen. Yeah, that won't last very long in my house anyway. Oh, okay, these little caddies. These are quite popular for like bedside nurseries and stuff. These seem pretty flimsy. I would want something more uh, stable than that, but I think we're out of the clearance section now. I'm really thinking on that. Mmm, I, I mean, this is nice. Look, it even has a hook on the side. Oh, oh no, <laughs> it's not a hook, it's just to, to hang the clothes on the inside, all right. Anyway, this is a really nice piece of furniture, really quality. Hey, remember when Aiden and Anise blankets first premiered and everyone was losing their crap over them? $40 for two muslin blankets. The swaddles, they are really nice, multi-use, you can use it as a nursing cover, obviously a baby blanket and uh, maybe cover the stroller if the baby's cold or, you know. Oh, oh, they sell like legit nurseries. Well, should we take a peek around? Beautiful, one for each hand. Is this appropriate for a bye-bye baby? Uh, anyway, my baby does not have a nursery. We'll have a bedside nursery, I guess. All of these things are very beautiful. Very lovely. Might I suggest to get a convertible crib so you get the most bang for your buck? What? Um, was ist das? A Smilo three in one pregnancy pillow? Tell me more. It's flexible, comfortable. Um, I'm sorry, it's just a pillow. I'm so confused. It's a pillow for $120. <laughs> How is this three in one? What is it, like a transformer or something? Like you open the zipper and there's three more in here? Fold and hold to suit you. Okay, I'm gonna keep walking. Okay, this is a great brand. Nice and gentle and natural for a new baby, especially um, sometimes they have eczema skin issues because 
Listen, the world is filled with chemicals that they're, they're just not used to yet. But if you feed them enough goldfish, they sure as heck will get used to it. Treat and soothe. Okay, this, this breast care, self-care routine. So this is a Freedom Mom uh, line uh, for breast care products. I'm trying to look down the aisles to see if they have any more Freedom Mom products. Okay, they, they do. So we're gonna check those out in just, a, in just a minute. Treat and Soothe. So they have a breast mask for engorgement. Amazing for hydration. They have a sore nipple set. This is great. Postpartum gummies for lactation. Thank you, Freedom Mom, for giving us the stuff that we really need. Breast care that puts, puts mom first. Pain and strain relief tape. This is Freedom Mom pregnancy line. So if you can tell the colors are a little different, they have a whole line. Their products are also sold on Amazon. They have a website if you wanna check them out. But this is like pain relief tape to tape your belly up. This is a two-in-one lactation massager. It's a vibration and heat to bust through buildup and get the milk flowing. I've heard great things about that. And then they have, for $50, you can get the bundle. So it's the whole kit with the lactation massager, the breast warmers, the mask for lactation, and then hydration as well. I didn't even see the warmers up here. Oh, because they're down here. Okay, <laughs> instant heat breast warmers. These alone are $20, so that's very cool. And then adjustable nursing pillow. Okay, I just find it so bizarre that in the middle of like the wipes and stuff, they sell Jergens Natural Glow. <laughs> like daily moisturizer. Looking for a self tan? Come no further than Bye Bye Baby. <laughs> okay, they've got all your self tanning needs. All right, so even more. Oh, what's this Oogie Bear? It's the better booger tool. Oh gosh, boogers, am I right? Okay, they've got a nose balm, chest rub. Oh, that sounds great. They have a snot spray. Gotta spray that crap out. A Derma Frida bath mitt. Fantastic for the skin. Um, this is an AccuDose pacifier. A flake fixer sponge. I love the names. Passy weaning. Oh, you can wean your baby with this passy system. Isn't that exciting that someone came up with that? Three in one nose, nail, and ear picker. Ooh, the ear one. That's That gets me excited. I like ear wax. I like getting the ear wax out. All right, what's this? It seems like a random bundle to have a Freedom Mom Perry bottle mixed in with this, but okay. Comes with Freedom nail clippers, the nose Frida, and the windy pipe to get the gas out if you feel like your baby is being particularly gassy. A head hugging hairbrush and comb. That's fun. Breathe Easy Kit. Oh, it's a whole kit. Okay, Vapor Rub, the Vapor Drops and Vapor Wipes. They have a hair detangler. I think everyone already has a thermometer nowadays. <laughs> Am I right? Um, they have a whole bunch of lactation stuff over here. Lactation cookies. You guys, you just buy like an oatmeal cookie mix and then add some brewer's yeast maybe some flaxseed in there and and that's really you know Ooh, but these are cinnamon mm -hmm. also they're pre-made so convenience sure iron supplements that's a plus okay freedom on brand oh this is what gets me excited Ooh, also what's this up here mio nipple nurture body boost stretch mark oil i'm way past that Okay, well, I'm literally sitting on the floor now because I'm getting comfortable to share this with you. Freedom Mom has a whole line of products to help you during labor and delivery and postpartum. Um, and also they have a line for C-sections, which is, oh my gosh, drooling fantastic. Because not only are you going to have a newborn, you're gonna be a new mom and you need to take care of you too. Check this out, Crap, cracked nipple saline spray. I can dig it postpartum gummies for pooping yep gummies if you don't like taking stool softeners do stool softeners come in like chewable form check it they do now sids bath tablets a lot of people are worried about the first poop after you give birth but honestly it's like not that bad just make sure you're eating and drinking a lot which you should be doing anyway and then take a stool softener like that one okay freedom on postpartum recovery essentials kit this is fifty dollars 
It comes with basically what you're going to need, disposable postpartum underwear that are fantastic. The um, instant ice packs, another fantastic tool that you're going to be thankful you have. They're instant ice maxi pads. That's what this, this is. And you can get your vagina on the rocks and I promise you, you're going to love it, especially the first few days postpartum. Um, and especially if you've gotten stitches, if you've torn, which is actually pretty, very common. Perineal cooling pad liners, those are like tux pads. It comes with the perineal healing foam. I can't speak on that, I've never used it before. And then it has a toilet top storage caddy. So that is exciting. The maxi pads alone, if you are just interested in these, are $20 and you get eight of them. And I mean, you can see the box is pretty large. So there are large and in charge ice packs. Delivery and nursing gown, if you're into that, it's $30, which is um, a great price if you've looked into like getting your own nursing gown. So this is labor and delivery and postpartum. So it comes with, oh, a bathroom essentials bag, the delivery nursing gown and socks. I would like some socks, please. I don't think they sell those separately. And then everything, oh, everything in the, postpartum kit except for this one also includes the peri bottle which i'm pretty sure they invented like the upside down peri bottle right here which is more ergonomic apparently uh it's 16 dollars. it's a bidet for your vijay and you gotta love that or you can use the one from the hospital is that's free right um and then they also sell the product separately so the cooling pad liners the healing foam this is a c-section recovery band incredible just gives you that extra support that you need to cover your uh, c-section scar i've never had one before and this brand is fairly new the freedom mom for c-sections but i love that they came out with this the perineal cooling comfort cushion incredible forty dollars for that they have the disposable postpartum underwear look someone bought some and then they have disposable c-section postpartum underwear and you guys can get this off Amazon too. So if you're, if you had an unexpected C-section, just pop on Amazon right afterwards and it'll be at your door, you know what I mean? Oh, cool. They even have the C-section recovery kit, which comes with everything you see here. Oh, and then the belly, the abdominal belly binder, the support binder. So it comes with that. Also silicone scar patches for your C-section incision skip the shower wipe all about that army bath yes please and then this one comes with the peri bottle uh so that's nice because you're still gonna need to care for all of that on top of having a dang surgery you know taking care of yourself after a surgery and having a baby is a lot of work okay i feel like i was there for a while but i'm passionate about postpartum and those products to help you they have some stuff that maybe for your hospital bag is that, that what this is for just trial size products i don't really know i need to pack my hospital bag i don't even know what i'm gonna put in it <laughs> snacks that's all you really need okay i did not know first of all they sell method cleaning products here what is this safely glass cleaner they have all kinds of products disinfectant cleaner did you know Drift sells a, oh, that's a laundry stain remover. Okay, also didn't know they sold that, but also an all-purpose cleaner, plant-based ingredients, no dyes, hypoallergenic. It's good for high chairs, toys, tables, countertops, crib rails, etc., etc. Also loving that they sell the scrub mommy. I might pick those up. <laughs> okay, if I had the choice to get this back and belly pillow versus the three-in-one, I pick this. <laughs> it's a contoured body pillow, so that's pretty exciting. Also, this nursery, like, I want to cry. It's just so beautiful. What's this? Bye Bye Rash Clean Dry Diapers. Oh my gosh, speaking of rashes, okay, I have only ever used, we like to do cloth diapers, um, but in the beginning, before the umbilical stump falls off, we do... Uh, whatever newborn diaper really I mean we're not too picky whatever the hospital gives us and then we normally have a pack or two of any like more natural ones but the wipes I wanted to mention water wipes are our absolute favorite we've been using them for 12 years it's just water and then a little bit of grapefruit extract 
sometimes my babies can be sensitive and now they have a whole bunch of different sensitive baby wipes. So seventh generation, Aveeno even has some, which that's exciting. I've just noticed some of my babies, if I switch the um, wipes, they are more likely to get a rash. So, oh, what's this? Water full, choose plastic free baby wipes. Oh, biodegradable for sensitive skin. Okay, I've never even seen these before. Okay, let's talk about sleepers. Where are the sleepers? Because I need some swaddles and stuff. Sleep sacks have not worked out for us. Maybe, I know they sell like a weighted one. It's very lightly weighted, but gives them the sense of comfort. Oh, another clearance item. They have an elephant rocker. That's pretty fun, but this is what caught my eye. Wait, what is this? Oh, a toddler bed. Oh yeah, that's pretty sweet. Um, this is a soft landing pillow scapes lounger for $70, but I do love that kitty cat. And uh, what's that? Oh, a little storage guy. Changing pads, <laughs> gotta love that. Oh wait, they do have some cloth diapers here too. Alva Baby on Amazon, I've heard great things about that and they're extremely affordable. Bum Genius is what I've used for 12 years. Also, whether you cloth diaper or not, I think it's important for you to have an on-the-go wet bag for soiled clothes or whatever, just to keep it in your diaper bag. You can put wet things in it and it'll keep it, everything else in your bag dry. Do you know what I mean? So uh, it comes in a bunch of different prints. They're like, that's expensive. What the heck? Oh, but $20, that's pretty on par. Wait, Sprout has waffles? It's like a Stroop waffle. I want some. <laughs> Let's be real, baby snacks are it. Oh, okay, is this like a gift? Oh my gosh, a baby shower gift? $61, what's inside? A $50 gift card? And all this stuff? <laughs> Every moment matters. Oh my gosh, a nursery essentials kit. Tell me more, what is it? I don't know, I can't take this stuff out. Okay, here's a backseat mirror, and I've seen people with like <clears throat> backseat cameras legit so i don't know this is 25 bucks i'm sure the backseat camera is a little bit more than that i'm gonna travel down this back wall real quick for you oh my gosh real quick <gasps> the woodland creatures oh my gosh they always excite me even though these are not woodland at all elephant and penguin but like the deer and the fox and oh just the whole vibe of this the trail mix up there so sweet but they have crib blankets and mobiles and uh, bed sheets, uh, you know, fitted sheets and stuff. Photo op fitted crib sheet. Oh my gosh, a photo op. Oh, I'm not even thinking about that. Poor fifth baby. I need a changing pad and a changing pad cover. They have a lot of different like print options for basically everything. Oh my gosh, Star Wars. How funny is that? A Star Wars mobile. There's some Disney stuff. Yoda, under the sea, ocean creatures. Oh my goodness, there's so many things. Lammies, oh, are those daisies? Sweet daisy collection. So sweet, is this pillow $25? Oh my gosh, kick me in the neck. Okay, pillows aren't safe anyway, right? <laughs> Let's keep on walking. Um, I really like the deer. Oh, they're so sweet. I don't know if I'm having a boy or a girl, so it makes it a little easier to not get too into all these cutesy things, you know? The swans and stuff. Oh, and the rainbows. Oh, okay, they have a whole collection. They've got, um, you know, artwork for your nursery or your wall storage caddy. I need to, is that a manatee again? What is this? Maybe it's a seal. You can move mountains. I, oh, <gasps> swaddles, have we made it to the swaddles? No, these are crib sheets or swaddles, I'm confused. Oh, receiving blankets. Okay, so basically you can use it as a swaddle. They feel nice, but I much prefer the muslin swaddles. I I mean, maybe because I live in Florida, they're not as thick, which is, well, it depends on the brand actually. They have a lot of baby blankets, baby, uh, what do you call these? Snuggles? <laughs> yes, Kim, that is exactly what they're called. Okay, more crib sheets, more blankets, more snuggles over here. Oh my goodness, I'm overwhelmed by the options. Oh, holy cow, holy cuteness. 
holy ballerina vibes behind me. <laughs> I love this. I wish my room looked like this when I was growing up. Here it is, the pillow for $25. Fit for a ballerina. Oh my gosh, look, even a little ballerina snuggie. Ooh, love this. I was gifted one of these uh, with my last baby and I thought it was so cute. A milestone blanket. Oh, that that is so fun. I bet they have all different kinds of milestone blanket options. Like here's another one, Gerber. Oh, that's cute. Okay, did I pass? Oh, I just ran into it. Ouch. Oh, okay, mountains. You can move mountains, just not with your hip. All right, what is this? Honest Baby Organic Cotton Crib Sheets. I need a uh, changing pad cover, but I do like these prints. Those are fun. Oh man, and they've got Blippi and stuff. Coco Malone. <laughs> oh, okay, so here's a projection smooth soother. <laughs> smoother, a baby shusher. I've heard crazy things about that. I just don't. I don't know. I'd rather have a sound machine, I guess. Here's another sound machine similar to the one that I picked up. Uh, looks portable, but it might just be small. Meditation mouse? Oh, two to five years. That seems cool. Night light alarm clock. I can dig it. I'm sorry, is this a bed? <laughs> this is the coolest bed I've ever seen. It's also $350. That gave me heartburn just looking at it. <laughs> okay, what's over here? Oh, this is so sweet. I looked into making one of these like rainbow wall decor hanging signs. Lambs and Ivy. That looks like a pretty nice quality brand. Oh, look at the prints and stuff for their crib sheets. Oh, those are spectacular. All right, and then they have, oh, Burt's Bees Baby. They've got bedding and a changing pad cover. Hey. I just need like all the changing pad covers in one section so I can pick my favorite print, you know? Burt's Babies, Organic, again. And then Aiden and Anise over here with blankets and, oh, changing pad covers. Hey, found a spot. Oh, look at the little, oh, I thought that was a mouse. It is an elephant. Ha ha ha. Check out this toddler bed fit for a queen. And then this toy box on wheels. Ooh, they have a lot of stuff for like a playroom. That's fun, or even just a bedroom, like to fit in the closet or whatever for the toys. Here's a crib and changing table set. Love that. Oh my word, they actually have so many more cribs back here and changing tables and furniture. Oh my word, and sleepers. Okay, I really wanna dive into the sleepers because you know, I, got, I almost got a snoo second hand but secondhand, they're still like a thousand bucks, you know? I found one for, I wanna say 800, but I couldn't bring myself to do it. Brand new, they're double that, uh, but I, yeah, I just still, even though it was a deal, you know? So lots of diaper changing bags. Hold on, I'm being drawn into these baskets. Mm, okay, I've seen enough. So diaper bags. Oh my gosh, so many options, right? It just depends on like what your preference is, what you like, do you want a backpack? Backpacks are becoming more increasingly more popular um, as the years go by. Remember when like Winnie the Pooh bags were it? Um, not sure they were ever it, but <laughs> some people sure thought they were. Carters, now it's more like your bag but you can facilitate all of your baby's things, right? Like Petunia Pickle Bottom. I mean, these are pricey. Oh, and they have Honest backpacks as well. Okay, so I didn't know they sold Honest diaper bags. I guess they're all over Tarnation with what they sell. Oh, more Petunia Pickle Bottom over here. Um, the resale value on these are actually, oh my gosh, is that Belle? $180. Oh, they've got Little Mermaid as well. I think if they had the Aristocats, oh my gosh, what? <gasps> this is the cutest. Okay, well, I love that, but I'm gonna have to pass on that. Here's Eddie Bauer. And then I don't even know what brands these are, but they all look very nice and modern and sleek and chic and woman across the room vibes. Um, 
Yeah. Oh, and then look, they have accessories. Actually, oh, that's for hand sanitizer. Always good to have in a diaper bag. They have a travel pouch, changing pads. Most diaper bags, if you buy them new, come with changing pads, but you know, oh, it's like a mini diaper bag you can put inside of your diaper bag. Okay, what other cool accessories do we see? I just see like changing pads and stuff. Oh, see? A wet bag. That's a nice one. They have a bunch of different options for the wet bags over here too. They have a plethora of like co-sleeper kind of, like right up to the bed, um, bassinets if you will. This one kind of looks like the one that I got. This one may be the one that I got. I got it secondhand. I did not spend $219 on it, nowhere close. So if you're looking for something and you're comfortable buying secondhand, I would definitely look into that because there's only so long that a baby can sleep in something like this, you know? until someone has to sell it. So like this one, 280, is this similar? It's a smart connect, illuminates, a better bedtime for you and your baby. I know since the Snoo came out, it's been several years. And so there are a few brands that have tried to recreate the magic of the Snoo. And really I've heard mixed reviews about this Snoo. And honestly, every baby sleeps differently. Should I even say that every baby sleeps? <laughs> <laughs> because wow right um, but a lot of them these days are able to uh, move so if that is something that you're looking for oh my gosh I found the swaddles okay swaddle blankets swaddle wraps two-in-one swaddles wearable blankets wearable blankets oh there's so many okay I'm gonna go back to basics here uh, nope still have no idea swaddle me okay the original hmm is this good? Adjustable baby wrap. Oh my goodness, look at those prints. All right, well, I'll get a couple and then, I don't know. <laughs> These prints are making me wanna cry. Like they're so adorable. I wish they had more gender neutral ones, but you know. Oh, what are you gonna do about that? Also, all the muslin swaddles are over here in the bundle packs. Okay, and then the Swaddle Up brand. So that's what this one looks like. I think you can like zip the sleeves up of, off of them. Oh, a transition one, oh, okay. I've never used this one before. It looks like a second layer of skin, which I guess is what they like. Oh, this is the one I was talking about, the Zen Pack. That little egg in the middle, that's like a weighted, gently weighted with beans. So that's supposed to help them sleep a little longer. Also, have you heard of, <laughs> What's the one? It makes them look like the Marshmallow Man. I can't think of the name right now, but I was very close to buying it for my last child because, oh, I just, you know, when you're sleep deprived, you'll try anything. This is like the peanut shaped one. I'm in the uh, changing pads now. It's a wipe clean changing pad. You don't need a cover for it. Apparently it doesn't like absorb anything or hold in smells. It's also $80, so... <sighs> I don't know about that. The last changing pad I got was when Avelina was born <laughs> 12 years ago and it was secondhand and it was like 10 bucks. So looking at the price of these, even a $30 one, well, $30 isn't too bad, but um, yeah, some of them are more. Oh, okay, so this one is 40 and it comes with a, a pad cover. So that's pretty good. It's another clearance section, but I can't believe we didn't see any of these, the Haka. So these are nursing pads, but the Haka is actually something that you just put on your other breast as you're nursing on the other side and it collects the letdown um, if you have an abundance of a supply and oversupply. So that's something to uh, note. I'm checking out these storage caddies and this Skip Hop brand seems pretty sturdy, but I picked it up and I touched it and the light came on and I thought, oh my gosh, how amazing is that for like nighttime changes and stuff? I mean, obviously I'm gonna have a night light, but that's pretty cool. Oh my word, am I in the market for a rocker? But you, woo. I saw one at Costco for like 400 and I thought that was expensive. Yeah, these are pricey, 500. Oh, this one's 480. Um, oh, I like the style of this one back here. That's pretty nice. And then they have the traditional ones with the ottoman back here. <laughs> um, I quite like 
I wonder if these pull out. Oh yeah, it looks like they do. So that's a nice option. This one looks nice and luxurious. So it's nice that they have all of these options so you can sit in them and test them out. They have a lot of pack and plays, which now triple as like so many things, right? Rock, play, relax. Oh, that's pretty fun. Um, yeah, you can use this as a sleeper and you can move it throughout your house. I'm also looking for a bouncer like this, a swinger or something. It says swing me. Hmm, well, nope. Okay, they have a lot of bouncers over here. Oh, wow. I feel like this is so upright. You know? I don't know. Uh, my Once Upon a Child has a ton of bouncers, so I'm hopeful of that I'll be able to find one secondhand. Also, swings, I feel like, is an essential. Um, my babies have always enjoyed the swings so there's that i bought one for avelina and we've had it for every child since i was lured to this section because i'm redoing the playroom and they have these like uh carpets that are like the foam i don't know how to explain it but you know the foam anyway they have a ton of toys for all ages really Okay, strollers. Oh, it's just such, oh, there are, the problem with strollers is that there's a million options, right? Baby carriers though, one of my all time favorite things. Um, also they have a ton of options with these as well. Throughout my years, I've tried Ergo, I've tried wraps, I've tried a lot of things. This, if I can find it, this is not it, but it's very similar to this. The brand is Boppy Comfy Fit, and I'll put it on the screen. It is my ultimate, my all-time favorite baby carrier, but I don't see it here. I just see the um, Comfort Hug, which I assume is very similar. They also have Ergo Baby Wraps, which are great, more of like a buckle system. The Boppy Comfy Fit is more like the the in-between. It's easy to adjust because it's like half wrap, half buckle. You buckle it around you, but then you wrap the rest. I just adore it so much. Um, and it's affordable. So if you're looking for something like this, that's the one I would recommend. I also 1000% would recommend a baby carrier just in general because like baby is so used to being next to you. They just love you so much. That baby loves you so, so much and um, they're gonna wanna be close to you for a long time. And if you have multiple kids and have other things that you need to be doing, it's very convenient to strap them straight to you. I'm just bringing you around, showing you all the car seats and strollers. I mean, if you can see, this is like the biggest section here. So many options for car seats and strollers. Uh, I mean, I couldn't even tell you which one is the best. I don't even know. It all depends on your preference, I suppose. I will say this one is luxurious. Oh my word. And also it's nice to come here and test them out and push them because they don't all push the same. Some of them turn differently or smoother, et cetera, et cetera. Um, oh, the Bob one, that's a jogging stroller. I've heard wonderful things about that. There's also one that I bought that I love. I can't remember the name of it, but it's great. Two, two, two of them. I'll pop two on the screen here and show you my two favorite for like a double stroller type of thing. Well, bye bye baby and bye bye my life savings. What did I buy? My next stop is actually Once Upon a Child. It's like the thrift store for babies and kids. So I'm going to see if I can find some of the things that I just didn't want to pay full price for. So, but thank you guys so much for watching and shopping around with me and seeing everything that Bye Bye Baby has to offer. Kind of glad it's very far from my house because um, I don't see myself like coming here very often, you know? But it's always fun every now and again, once every three years. <laughs> but they did have a large variety. But anyway, thanks so much for hanging out and I'll see you next time. Bye.